properties are. Okay. What? Okay. That, I was confused about that. Yeah, there's a spellcraft tech to detect properties, we have to detect magic. Mm -hmm. But otherwise, you automatically detect the magic. You know that the it is magical, but you use a, you put two, uh, if you give time to, with the time with a spellcraft check and a knowledge okay, arcana, Karen. it'll tell you what it is. Karen. Um, How you come can the clearly... smell of hand sanitizer reminds me of Palo Angels? I don't know. I'm trying to say something. Karen, right now you can tell that the, um, that the scale has brief traces of necrotic, um, effects. Huh. I'm glad I'm not carrying that the scale. Hell the DC it looks like it has a bit of a unlife aura. What is um, it? I'm having it's many experiences. The, the, well, the, the DC yeah. was actually a bit team, but he way far and ways are past that. Okay, guys. Let's what talk one at a time and not over each other. We are starting to have that issue. Yeah. And now oh, nobody yeah. wants to talk. All Glenn having experience was to build an necromancy. Asked if he can see this object. Okay. That's all. That's what I'm okay. What did he find? Oh. Um, I don't know what guy did. By the looks of this, I don't want to explain what it does it's to gruesome effects, but I suggest we burn it. Is it the scale that's necrotic? Is that what we're saying? Yes, yes. The scale. Well, no, no, it's not necrotic in in of itself, but it contains brief traces of residue of necrotic elements. I would ask, may I please have it because I wish to dispose of it properly. All the hands that you gave me. So necrot necrotic scale is that what it's called? Um, it's not specifically called anything. It's just a scale with necrotic properties. Or necrotic. Could you, just, get, or like, like could you detect any alignment aura on that, Gabriel? Say what? I can't hear you from a uh, barking dog. I'm uh, mute. Could you see if it has an alignment disposition? I'm uh, Can I cast a spell to detect alignment on it, please? Um, I'm just going to assume, yeah. Uh, what kind of check do you want to make up? It's going to make sense. I want to detect what an alignment the scale has on it. Okay, give me a second. I find a rule for that. I'm just I'm trying to check. Um, I'm gonna assume this is a use magic device check. Use magic? What? I'm gonna assume this is a use magic device check. It's a detect alignment. It, it, it's a spell. It's called detect alignment. Oh yeah. 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 Um, chaotic evil. I'm going to say this. This scale has many things about it that are not well. That is not supposed to be meant in this world. I will dispose of the scale properly. Puts it in backpack. Also, um, by the way, side note, um, Kieran, as you cast detect magic, do you also notice that there's some other magic somewhere else in the room? Perception check to locate it. It should have an aura, so it should stick yeah, out. Yeah, roll perception. It's a DC 10. Alright. <laughs> okay, then. Um, based off of the, um... Based off of the, um... Uh, based off of the aura, you can clearly see that magic lines from here to here. Alright, I'm gonna sneak up close and try to get a better look at it. Okay. Not... Um, Everybody stay behind me, there's something up ahead. Also, side note, as you turn the corner, some more zombies. Huh. Um, after this next combat, guys, I need to cut out. Um, hey, why? Because I gotta go to bed because we're going fishing in the morning. Okay. So, anyway, that is a call. Just two of them. All day. Can I roll perception to see what they 
<laughs> Roll perception to see what? To see what kind of zombies they are. That's a that's a knowledge. That's test. engineering. Oh yeah, that's knowledge that's engineering. That's you say? Engineering or yeah. religion? Okay, you can tell they're normal zombies. Three. <laughs> yeah. Gabriel, Gabriel doesn't know what they are. They th Gabriel he thinks they're thinks... he thinks they're humans that are just shambling around like stupid. No, yeah. Gabriel thinks they're rats. Gabriel thinks <laughs> that they are dinosaurs. <laughs> yeah. Uh. More zombies, guys. Okay. Is it bad that I'm listening to Pokemon right now? The battle uh, music no, Pokemon? it is not. Oh, wait, not Arizona, are you moving? Are you moving anywhere, Arizona, or are you in the back? Like, completely in the back. Oh, are you just AFK? Arizona, sweet Arizona. <laughs> Move. Uh, are you moving anywhere, or are you just staying there? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, is a summary of what you ha of what was going on before you had to go to the restroom. Uh, Kieran detected some magic. It's over here, like on this line here, and two he turned the corner, and two zombies are here. Summary. Okay. Uh, Leon, it's your turn. I'm just gonna assume it's same combat style. I'm gonna roll in this different you guys. Let's see two, that's ten. I make it this far and I can't do anything else really. Uh, oh wait, gonna... the water's moving, isn't it? Uh the water is difficult to run. It... Yeah, I can... <laughs> I can make it like that. That that is that constitutes my move. Oh, give me a second while I get these guys in here. Um, two. These zombies are surprisingly quick on uptake, probably from hearing the battle earlier, and um, are coming straight at you after you guys move first. So you can't move, so Magnus, your turn. Uh, can I take a shot with my crossbow? Yes, you can. Okay, roll damage. That's a sorry, Ken. Yeah, sorry. Didn't actually update that. Uh, so, it's a 1d10 damage. Yeah. The black line is a line of magic that I've detected. You hit it in. You hit it in its eye, but it doesn't seem to do much. Yeah, because that's piercing. Okay. Um. You want to make a move, uh, Magnus? Uh. Yeah, I'll move a little bit forward. Moving on. Move now remember, your yeah. heavy crossbow has, takes a full round action to reload. Yeah, I know. Go, Pikachu. Gabriel, your turn. The power of light compels you. You moved to my spot, damn it. Oh well. The power of light compels you. No, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> this is How far is the radius? 30. 30. Can you move right in front of me between me and Leon? <laughs> I'm going to fly over to here and to just use it there. Okay. Oh, wait. How high in the air are you flying? Uh, above the water. That's not helping me. Like, how high? How high is the water? Like 10, 5 feet, 15 feet. How high is the ceiling? 20 feet. Then 5 feet up. Okay. Shattering the energy! Wow, shoot. Hmm. To that right, one so... and to that one. Um, wait, are you rolling for channel energy, or? Channel energy, ener you know, and I should probably put a text underneath it that says channel energy. That's like his mil one of his million uses a day. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna have this for the fa I'm gonna have the one that took one is gonna take an extra two points of damage. Cool. 
Um, so, zombie's health is... So that one takes... Okay. You're purifying in divine light. Completely... Um, like, the flesh is burning out their bones as we speak. Okay. Zombie's turn. The zombie goes up to Gabriel and tries to hit him. Went to damage. Gabriel, I'm here. I'm just writing something on on the uh, basically making it a Pokemon attack. All right, so it's seven. Yeah. All right, we're good. Argle in the your turn. Yeah, move up. That's fifteen feet. And let me see. What's the radius on channel energy? Thirty feet. You won't make it. You can make it to here and here. They won't make it to the last guy. Yeah, you can make it to that first one. Might, well, I, might I say that you might want to heal me? I am the main healer of the party. Answer. The main healer uh. of the party that healed only after the entire fight went on. You guys are I'll fine. Cast, I'll cast channel energy to enemies because I can come up and stabilize you if you're dying. <laughs> he can't move that far. He's a dwarf. <laughs> The funny thing about me is, if I die, I can't come back. Well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Okay. You also so have I've already to got my next. I've already got the next character idea thought up. You've also got to really die, though. Is the thing you don't just go negative and you're dead. There's no, if I hit negative negative ten, I die and I like disappear. Yeah, but that's negative ten. You, you, I don't think you'll hit that bad. Mm. Okay, so. Let me roll, let me roll Will here. Uh, what's the Will save? <laughs> it was so For him, 12. <laughs> okay. I highly doubt this will work at all. Ogolin laughs Wow, at him. okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> that guy that can't... Got... <laughs> I was going to say, you got really lucky, and the beast eradicates, getting the full brunt of the blast. So, yeah, there's that. That the guy other... can't roll saves... For his life, literally okay. to save his life. One, two, three. That's fifteen, twenty-five. Okay. So this guy moves here. I highly doubt Gabriel wants to take an attack of opportunity. Gabriel, do you want to take attack of opportunity? Gabriel. Okay, I'm gonna assume he doesn't. Okay, it still doesn't. Yeah, whatever. Okay, it goes off the armor. Karen, yeah, your turn. All right. I'm gonna draw. Uh, draw. I can't even really do anything. Everybody's in the way. I shout to the rest of the group. You shoot me, I'll kill you. I used to have a dog that was like Hank, Hank, Hank. Sorry. Actually, I'm gonna t since this seems pretty much under control. I'm gonna not cross the line. I'm gonna do a spellcraft check to see what this magic thing is. Okay, roll d twenty. All right. This is actually very high DC, so keep that in mind. Hell, if we weren't in combat, we could do a take twenty. Yeah, we can always take twenty later. Okay, roll for um, spellcraft. Okay. You cannot determine what the line does. Hmm. Arizona, it's your turn. Doom, 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 doom. Shoot at the zombie. Shoot DM. at it, and I will kill you. Shoot to Arglin and Leon and hit the zombie. DM. No, don't do that. Kill. Yeah. I'm showing the DM something right now, by the way, guys. There is a way you can make a, a straight line on this map just by doing that. What? That? It's called. Oh, yeah, uh, draw block. shape. Yeah, draw shape. Okay, so. You. <laughs> almost drew its neck. Alpha, it's your turn. Okay. Get the safes out of here. Yeah, I didn't just draw anything. 
So five feet, ten feet, fifteen feet. That should be in my move range. And just left undead. Um, you're standing next to an undead while you're doing this. Attack of opportunity. That is true. Doing what? Doing what? Casting standing spell. Next to an undead. While casting spell, attack of opportunity by zombie. Unless he said, unless he states that he is casting defensively. How far are you casting states, defensively? If he states, I am casting defensively, then he does not provoke an attack of opportunity. Okay. Alpha, are it you... doesn't that require a feat to be taken, though? No, it does not. No, it, no, it does not. Uh, the you don't take a penalty per se, but you have to make a spellcraft check. Yeah. Okay. I was gonna say there has to be something to make that balance. It's like, oh no, I'm casting this defensively, so you just explode. No, no, you have to make a concentration check. Yeah, of course and it's it... high. You know how hard it is to freaking cast defensively. Not really. Yeah, it's, with counter casting, um, you get plus four to it. Yes, it is. That is. So. Remy, do your dirt. One sec, I'm looking something up. What is oh, this? Trait. Focus mine. It only has two HP. Just end it. Whatever. It and even if damage. you don't hit him, it's just an hard kill for Leon. Mozart? What the hell? <laughs> Wouldn't have hit anyway. You hit the wall. Leon, it's your turn. Hold on, if he, I thought he asked to take a penalty. Yeah, attack back. He does. Attack. It doesn't matter, though. I don't care. He just... He screws up so bad. Um... Dead. You hit it. Okay, roll well, damage. I kill it. If it had two health, it thing's dead. <laughs> I overkilled it. Okay. Last of the zombie fall. Killed it, brought it back, and killed it again. Okay, so what do you want to do now, guys? Caroline uh, wounds on myself. I'm going to uh, take a 20 to I'm going to uh, take off my armor so and take a bath. That, that's probably not advised. And we don't know if we're done yet. I want to take. You still haven't found the source of the necromancy yet. I want to go swimming. God damn it! Uh, I'm gonna take a twenty on my uh, spellcraft check to determine what the magic line is. Okay. Well, uh, there goes about a good maybe four hours of him doing that. Uh, two minutes. That that's what taking a twenty requires. Well, that changed it in Pathfinder. Okay. Uh, good news. Any Does anybody need healing? No, nope, no, nope, only you. Okay. Th this is what happens when the oracle goes head first in the combat. Well, I didn't go head first. I just tried to kill him with my so holy you're taking twenty. If it's a necromancer, I want, I want to try Kyren. and fight him. Kyron, uh, you yep. say twenty? Yes, I okay. do. Okay, so you can clearly tell that's an alarm spell. Does somebody have this uh, this spell magic? That's way above my skill level there, buddy. I thought it was a level yeah. one spell. No. Oh. God damn it. I so, just stole an axe. Am I, am I assuming that you tell the group that that's what it is? Yes. And I'm going to put my hand oh, shit. through the spell. And just so you know, and just okay, you put your hand through the spell, and because you use the tech magic, you hear a very loud ringing oh, in your ear. Fuck. But only oh, Kyra's. Oh, God! Kyra. Now he knows we're coming. He knew oh. we were coming to begin with. Not what? This more divine gifts? No, he knew no, no. It... Kyron hears. Only Kyron hears it because he has a detect magic on. No, no, yeah, but he, he told the party what it was. Uh, yeah, but only he can hear the loud ringing, though. But we know it's an alarm of sorts. Yes, you do know it's an alarm. The, 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 it's already been I breached. Think that will work. Um, this is a specific type of alarm that a zombie does not trigger it. Not to mention, it's already been triggered. Yeah, it's already been triggered, anyways. Well, 
Let's just go through then. Hey, fighter first. I say, I don't. I don't believe that any of us have in our repertoire the ability to disable this. So, what is the other means? Just go through. Uh, look for other ways around before jumping to conclusions. Too late for that. Survival. I, I, yeah, he's already triggered the alarm. I know. I know. This well, is why we discuss let's things. Let's the way, people. Did did they not teach you to go. problem solve up in heaven or wherever the hell you came from? I mean, seriously, come on. I mean, I'm not yeah, going to lie. Came well, from that was a stupid ass move. No, it wasn't. There was no other way for us to get around this. If you look over here, there is no other way over here. We don't Just know. Another you, okay. There. You still look anyway. You always make sure every like avenue of chance is oh. looked at. They really didn't teach you much in heaven, did they, Angel? Argolin attempts to cast a silent spell on Leon. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Like, are you really gonna do that? Okay, guys. Ah. New zone. I don't think. I, I you, you say, I don't think. Behind behind Leon. Leon. You go down the hallway and find the ladder. In this ladder, you are led to a large cavern, and here the tracks end. Hmm. I very well doubt that he would not know that we were coming. Holy crap! This map is huge. Yeah, the squares are like we have to zoom out if I can fit the thing on the screen. Give me a oh. second while I get the tokens on. Um, do you guys want to roll um, perception in the meantime? About to say, I'm about to. Yeah, roll let's uh, let's do perception. Rolling perception. You never know. I might have done it on purpose for a reason, guys. There, I fixed it. See. I still failed to see yeah. anything, but I fixed it. That wasn't a, a, a very good perception check on my part. Yeah, it was ter I'm absolutely to find terrible a for token. me. Hey, it can't be worse than mine. Arizona, this, Nick, this and myself, I think, have the highest so far. Yeah, yeah. that's everybody. Okay, oh, so man, you guys notice uh, you guys notice a very menacing. Uh, sorry, if this is see. Um, I'm gonna try to find a better one. Wait, can you guys see this? Yeah, we can see it. Really? Uh, here, I'll, yeah. I'll move it over here. You guys notice a very, um, a very menacing-looking skeleton rise out of the water, wearing, um, wearing. Right yeah, yeah, right there. Wearing, um, I'm trying to find what he's wearing. A breastplate. Um. Hey, I he stole cast... my armor. Religion... No, can I look. Can I cast a religion check? Uh, yes, you can. Uh, and this one right. is, this one is a uh, very. Religion, go! Okay, Gabriel, you immediately identify this as a skeletal champion. I'm guessing you know, I keep. Can I'm I get a link to it? Please? Guessing Gabriel relates this to me, or Gabriel re can relate I get to everybody? The party, I mean. Can I get a, a character link, please? Uh, sir, yes, you can. It does say we do get to know the abilities and everything, so yes, that makes sense. Uh, well, I'm just going to assume you guys are shouting to talk to each other, so I'm just going to post it in group chat. Well, it'd take a while to explain all the, uh, everything it could do, so... No, you can just say, it's so-and-so, skeletal champion. It, it It's fairly easy to explain, if you read it. Okay, you say so. Because all, all these creatures from Pathfinder are new to me, that's what I'm asking. Uh, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna tell you guys, don't hit it with anything that is round, that is bludgeoning. That is that is bludgeoning or isn't? Is not. Shit. Do not hit it. Only hit it with slashing or piercing uh, things. No, no, bludgeoning is the only thing that affects it. Very much. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, you're right. It's DR5 except for bludgeoning. Yeah, that's what I say. Hmm. Does magic do if magic you can, weapons? If you can deal more damage. Uh, magic weapons depends. Is it a slashy magic weapon? Is it a uh, my, magic uh, weapon? I have an arcane pool ability that allows me to make one of my weapons magic for ten rounds. Yes. Yeah, so well, uh, we if, if it's a pure scene weapon, it still doesn't matter. What? Wolf for initiative. Yeah. All right. Roll for initiative. Initiative. Yay! Holy shit, Leon's not first for once. 
He comes in third still, but... Or fourth now, actually. Hmm. Holy crap, Magnus. <laughs> you know, I did that earlier, and nobody was like, holy crap to me. I had a 29. Well, it's common for you. <laughs> I had a 29, guys. Come on. It's incredible for him, but for me, it's... It's, eh. it's, it's one more than what I had. It's not, all right, it's one more than what he had. Hey, guys, yeah, but you add in all your turns. And you guys then put the numbers. Eh, fuck, I have. I mean, I had this the will, other half of that. This will probably be your hardest fight so far. With one skeleton? <sighs> one skeleton. Yeah, here's the problem. Most of us have oh, slashing weapons. We have one, basically one guy that can reliably do... Uh, and most, and th at least three of us can and easily destroy undead. My core robot tell by accident. This is true. Yes, I, I am built specifically against undead, so... I got a, what, a 17, um, that, 9? There's one thing you gotta remember, though. Is that how you put it? You they get, this thing gains a bonus against channeling. Oh. I well, that went those so, um, so I'm gonna go up and touch it. I don't. It, it makes it useless against you, Arglin. It doesn't make it useless against Gabriel. <laughs> no, he can still touch. His channel so high. Channel. 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 I got other stuff. I uh, can... guys, put in your numbers. I did. Um. Uh, Kale, I got a question for you about this guy. What? Can he be stunned? Yes. No, he's I would assume. Oh wait, no one. Uh, Kyron, what'd you roll? Uh, hang on. I don't think he can. I mean, oh, it might you, be different you in this 21. one. And. Yeah, so he's immune to it. He's immune to it. Gabriel rolled oh, yeah. an eight. Immune to stun. Darn it. Gabriel rolled an eight. Yes. Okay. So I'm pretty sure that. a stun. I'm pretty sure stun is a, a mind affecting. Yeah, it doesn't affect him. Okay, Magnus, ah, it's your turn darn. first. So, ten, twenty, thirty. Uh, I I notice you're automatically breaking the first rule of combat. What? Which is let the enemy come to you instead of go to your enemy. <laughs> We can't, can't charge the enemy. Yeah, we can't make it that far anyway, so it's not a huge deal. Yeah, that's as far as I can make it. I know, but that means he gets to attack you before you can attack him. Uh, d uh, d uh interventions, interventions. Just, just do this. <laughs> Who cares? Oh, Please. good God. Arizona. This is going to be a, a difficult dude. fight. Oh, shit. There are actually very few people who are capable of killing this thing. The, the first three obvious... Okay, Arizona hits it really hard. For okay, one. It's, not. <laughs> it's a hard one. And it is a blood. It does count as bludgeoning. I know it counts as bludgeoning. Also, he should. He, he, it's a lie. He didn't hit. AC twenty one. Oh no, touch. That's right. Fucking pistols. Fucking yeah. guns, man. And it's not the, the the when you shoot. It's not bludgeoning. It's ballistic. Kyron, your turn. It's All technically right, uh, kerosene and bludgeoning. Simultaneously. God damn it. Yeah, pistol says, pistol says I'm broken as fuck. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna um, do a uh, perception it's... check for my post to look around for um, some sort of light mace or blunt weapon or something. You know, okay. I'm gonna tell you guys something that I shouldn't tell you guys. You guys can make a blunt attack with the with the sword or something like that, but it takes a minus four to hit. I have a rapier, so it, it, it's not really gonna... Not that useful, I have a shield that I'm gonna pull out and use as a ma my main weapon for this. <laughs> um, Kyron, you do not see anything um, on the stone parts, but you can see through the water. Leon takes off his boot what? and kicks his ass. Um, you cannot see anything like on any of the stone. However, you can see through the water, and you cannot see anything on the stone right now. Alright, so I don't see anything. No, Leon, it's your turn. Hmm. Uh, entire turn is going to be putting away the sword. Um, okay. Little action. What? Yeah, but then I have to. I'm getting the shield out as well and using in that hand, while still holding, having the torch in the other. So it's basically shield is in what would normally be my sword hand. You can okay. hit it with. The, you could hit it with a with a torch. Yeah, but it's, it's called not, an improvised weapon. I know, and I take a penal, a massive penalty to hit. I don't with the shield. Well, you take a massive penalty to begin with. You get minus four to hit with your shield. Not if I'm do not uh, the way I've explicitly mentioned it. Notice that I said the sh the torch is in my 
the normal shield hand while the shield is at, is in my main hand. It is not an offhand weapon in this circumstance. It is my main weapon. Are you gonna sh do you have the feet shield bash? F uh, no. It's a martial weapon though. Link it to me and I'll I'm just I'm not trying to tell you no you can't do that. I'm just saying normally you have to have shield bash. It's a it's a martial weapon. I've looked at I've looked at it already. It uh, huh. a heavy shield is a martial one-handed martial weapon. Let me just let me just check out here to see if I'm if you're yeah. noticing anything. Let's see. I mean, don't get me wrong. I don't. I do want you to kill this thing as quickly as possible, so we can get the hell out of here. But, and, you know, I mean, and, try and to ironically, keep... you're getting in the um, way of it. Um, actually, he there is no feat called sealed bass. He's automatically able to do a sealed bass. The only thing is that there's an improved sealed bass. Yeah, and I and lose. Also, I lose however, my shield bonus when I do Keep in mind, this. though. Yeah, you lose your shield. Yeah, bonus. I know. I, I know that. I'm. I'm. I have a 20 AC. I should hypothetically be fine, but against this, I don't know. This, this could hit any of us really, really easily. Like, it's going to hit freaking Gabriel, like, instantly if it gets close. So oh, that's why he, that's why I put yeah, it out here. Yeah, that, so that's that's, why, that's my turn is I, I just switch out weaponry, oh, basically. Keep in, mind, keep in mind, this place has a 30-foot roof. Hmm. So we could so just Gabriel, fly all the way up there. Yeah, and Gabriel's on uh, <laughs> five feet above water level. So, Leon, what's your turn? It was just putting the sword away, getting the shield out. Okay, Argon, main turn. hand. Okay. Let me just get out my trusty ruler. Remember, okay. water is difficult terrain. It takes well, 10... Well, good for water. Each I'll square is 10 Bane. feet. <laughs> You'll cast Bane? Yes. Okay. DC 12 will save. Okay, this thing has a will of... <laughs> Plus 3, so yeah. You are not going to get this. You man. might, hypothetically. If I roll like I do... Uh, no. no. If I roll like I do, I was about to say, but then no. So it didn't land? No, no it did not. God damn it. Nice try, though. That was actually a fairly good idea. Okay, the skeleton. Oh, dear lord. Um, the skeleton. Hold on, let me see here. Skeletal champion. Here, let me see. Skeleton look... calls in the A-bomb. Hold up, I'm just checking to see its movements. Okay, 30. So, 1, 2, 3. It, it oh. goes to here, but does not attack Magnus. Interesting. Gabriel, Gabriel your turn. Hmm, most intriguing. My turn? Yep. Alright, let me take a look one last time at this creature. So fly over and poop on him. Uh, uh, initiative is ordered. It, it is yeah. ordered. We don't have, like, 16 people fighting. That's why it looks so weird. So, Gabriel, your turn. I'm going to hover 10 feet above it. It's where it can't touch me. Okay. I'm going to be. I'm 10 feet above, which means that he cannot swing at me. This is what I'm getting at here. Yeah, I know. And I have. Okay, so <laughs> then we're going to. And you're going Does to. Does it really? Win. No. Does it have a plus 10 to jump? No. Okay, because I was about to say. Just keep going. Channel energy. Joel's new nickname is Porkchop. Of course. Yeah, it's got a plus seven to that though, so. Well, if it doesn't work, then it's good to go. Oh no! Oh. He he shrugs it off like it's nothing. Uh, yeah, he takes half damage, right? Half damage. I think that's yeah. Three. Jesus. Yeah. The hell is that? I'm still super I'll deadly with my shield. Turn. This is ridiculous. <laughs> your turn. I'm guessing that a touch attack doesn't work. The best offense, the best defense, am I right? A range touch attack is perfectly fine. You can make a range touch No, attack. I'm guessing that does not hit. Oh, I'm wait, let me go off. check. I had a whole plan and I'm all the light on sure. Bain landing. <sighs> um, no, it does hit, surprisingly. Oh, okay. He has a touch. A, he has a touch of twelve. So it's attack first. You lucky bastard. Three. Wow. You guys actually made me make Minty out of this fight. Uh, Magnus, your turn. You don't have any strength mod. He's a he's a caster. No. Magnus, your turn. 
Uh, yeah, you did see it for one. Magnus. So My mic was muted yet again. Yeah, keep keep an eye on that. You failure. No, I'm saying endure this. That's going to be. You easy. hurt your hand on the arm. Points. It's all gonna end. Arizona, very bad. your turn. Could shoot the thing again. <laughs> shoot it again. Shoot yes, it again. He shoot has that. <laughs> Shoot it no, in the neck, it's a knife. It, pu it puts the lotion on the skin or else it gets the hose it again. It does hit. Roll damage. Fucking range touch attacks, man. Okay. Oh, Sharon, if I Sharon. die... Oh, man, if you um... die, something wrong happened, because you shouldn't be able to get hit. I'm just saying, if I do die... <laughs> I already have my idea for my next character. I'm gonna be a laser guy. Hmm. Well, yes, okay, Kieran, it's your turn. Alright, uh... I really yeah, I'm don't really have anything I can do unless I can find a mace somewhere, so... I'm going to... take a move action and... um... Soap some more? Yeah, I'm gonna try to move... Hang on, I'll map it. I'll, pro I'll jump over here. <laughs> Um, that's an acrobatics check. That's fine. How far of a jump is it? It's, uh, ten feet, I'd say. DC 17. <sighs> 17? Yes, it's two squares. One, two, or... He's jumping, no. so... Oh, he fails anyway.